What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Tay Get Money 313, aka Step Tay, aka STA the Game, aka Tay. What is good with y'all, man? Hey, I know I'm kind of late, but yesterday when I seen the news and stuff, <clears throat> sorry, y'all, my voice is a little cracking because I, you know, I got some little, a little sickness going on. But hey, um, yesterday I was at work, man, and I seen some amazing screenshots from the 2K stuff. Like, I seen uh, Anthony Davis, Brian James. I mean, I've been seeing them, but I seen Kawhi Leonard, Paul George, KD, all of them. Like, and I seen the ratings of them. Like, I'm like, whoa! But before we even get further into this video, man, make sure y'all give the video a thumbs up, join the family, subscribe, bro. Let's hit 700 subscribers. You feel me? I stream every day, bro. I stream every day. It's either I drop a video or I stream every day. So if you want to know my schedule, it's a it's really a day to day basis type schedule is what I'm on right now until I have until all my free time is really took up. But until then, I will be every day, day to day basis type thing with the uh, with the streaming and stuff. But let's get it right into this video. Look at this: the highest overall players on the game, two ninety sevens, bro. Don't y'all think it should be at least a ninety eight or ninety nine? Like Kawhi Leonard didn't perform like he was a ninety eight or a ninety nine or ninety seven. Like we don't even know who a ninety nine is this year. But look at the first look at these two. Look at this. Bro, that screenshot is crazy with the Kawhi Leonard with the smooth back braids. You got Brown with the <laughs> looking all sweet and jump, bro. They jump crazy, man. 2K is a month and some days away. Or like literally, bro, like right around the corner. Nah, they don't have Damian Lillard overall rating, but he has a 92 overall rating in NBA 2K19. I really felt like he deserved a, a 93, 94, uh, or 95 almost. He he really played his ass off that whole entire season last year. You know what I'm saying? Like, Damian Lillard balled out of control. That's his official first look at 2K20. I like the way it look. It look it looks different. Like, it looks like it looks like 2K19, but it looks different at the same time. Like, it looks like it's a different game. You know what I'm saying? Let's get into the next screenshot. Look at his first official look in a Brooklyn Nets uniform. It looked good. And Kyrie Irving, like, he ready to ball. He ready to play. His overall rating is a 91. Now, is that a little bit underrated? Is it over? No, I don't. I really don't know. You know what I'm saying? Kyrie could have performed better, but injuries, due to injuries, he was out a little bit during the season. So I'm not mad at the rating that he got, but he's way better than the 91. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm going to say. I feel like he should have got better. As I go through this list and break down who is the highest, LeBron James is a 97 overall. Kawhi Leonard is a 97. Giannis Antetokounmpo is a 96. Kevin Durant is a 96. That's here you got your first official look at KD in a Brooklyn Nets uniform, man. He, he look good, man. He look like he ready to ball. He got to get healthy, though. Know? I want to see him on that court. I'm kind of mad he left go to state, but hey, you got to make business moves. You got to make decisions. You got to make choices that you got to live with in life. I hope that was a good decision for him. But as I keep going down the list, I hope they drop more screenshots of more people. Like, we already seen Jimmy Butler, Kimball Walker. We already seen Carl Anthony Towns. I want them to drop James Harden, Steph Curry, um, Joel Embiid, Jokic, Russell Westbrook, Clay Thompson. Like, I want, them, I want to see them. But as I continue to go down the list on the overall ratings, you have Steph Curry. Never, he's a 95. Anthony Davis, a 94. Paul George, a 93. Damian Lillard, a 92. Joel Embiid, 91. Kyrie Irving, a 91. Jokic, a 90. Russell Westbrook, a 90. Klay Thompson, a 89. He does not deserve an 89. Klay Thompson should be one of the 91, 92. Even a 93. He's a... He, bro, this is a legit argument. That man is a all. He's a superstar, bro. He can do everything. He can dribble. He can shoot. He can lay a ball up. He can play defense. Like what can't you see? What don't you see? Clay Thompson do? Like what doesn't that man do that he don't deserve a better overall? Even Cat. Cat could have got a ninety. I feel like they could have hit the ninety borderline, but they probably did that for their ratings because of their injuries. They probably did that because once they come back or once they start back playing, they're going to progress like they're as they could. Put, as they perform throughout the season, they over <laughs> excuse me. Their overall rating is going to grow. The go up, man. That burp threw me all off track, man. My bad, y'all. But yeah, man. I feel like some of these ratings, I feel like should have been better. They could have been better. But hey, it is what it is. Um, and will I be trying to hit ninety nine again in two K twenty? I actually will be taking 2K20 a lot more serious than I took it this year. Once I hit 99 this year, I really was like, yeah, I don't even, you know, I was just playing around. Like, now when I play, sometimes I play seriously. Sometimes I play for fun just to have fun. 
But will I be attempting to hit 2K20 early? And yes, I will be attempting to hit 2K20 early. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't, I don't, I don't have the best equipment and stuff right now. As you see, I be screenshotting. I be doing my research. I do it all on my game, and I go to Share Factor and I use it. You know, I don't have the best equipment. I don't have, I don't, I don't have the things that everyone else have yet. But I'm going to get them in order to advance my my content and my league to. Uh, get to where I want to be in this stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? I want to be a professional gamer one day. I want to do this. I want to make content for the YouTube community, the 2K community. I want to make content. I want to do great things in this community. I feel like I belong here. I'm a good player, man. I feel like, I really feel like I belong here. Um, Being uh 2K19 wasn't bad. It was it was all right. It was kind of fun. You know what I'm saying? I had my experience. I had my last. I had my heated moments. I had all of that. But I'm really excited and ready for 2K20, man. I'm really excited. I'm waiting on that shit to get here, man. I really hope the dual the dual archetypes I heard was brought back. They confirmed or whatever. But the parks and stuff. I'm really waiting on the parks to see what we really finna have. What's really finna go on? Like what's really finna be it when we get 2K20? Like I'm excited for the for the 2K20 atmosphere. Like I'm ready for the rewards i'm ready to be great i'm ready to be immortalized again i'm ready to to live it you know what i'm saying i'm ready to experience be just go in there and go crazy just make everybody respect me you know what i'm saying just just go in this year humble and do my thing man i'm trying I'm, i promise y'all we're gonna hit 99 again this this time i'm grinding i'm looking for a bigger score in the 2k community i'm looking to get a name out here i'm looking to draw myself attention you know what i'm saying but I'm not going to hold y'all too much longer, man. I got to get ready to go to work, get up out of here, man. This is it for the video, man. I just wanted to show y'all them, them screenshots I seen, man, yesterday. It's your boy, Take It Money 3 on 3. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Go subscribe to my other YouTube channel at TL Mafia. And your boy out of here, man.